Hey there, I'm Valerie, and we've got the kitchen gadgets and gizmos to help you cook a show-stopping meal or delicious dessert. This blueberry brie grilled cheese is perfect for a spring day. Check it out. here to show us how we're going to be able to cook an egg. Are you guys ready for this? Like it's inside of the shell. But no shell. Except there's no shell and there's no peeling involved. Wait a second. <laughs> that, that sounds like magic. It is magic. <laughs> These are egglets, you guys. These are the hottest uh, item on television. In fact, they're back ordered everywhere else. You can't hardly find these anywhere. So we're giving you the deluxe set here at HSN. So what comes with that? So you're actually getting six of the little egglets, which is actually gonna give you a hard boiled egg with no shell. So if you have ever had this madness happen to you, where you have oh, had yeah. your hard boiled eggs, all gross, they're falling apart, you can't get the the shells off of it. This is most people's experience with hard boiled eggs, okay? Now egglets has come along and you're actually gonna remove the shell before you cook them, which is genius, okay? It's in the silicone holder, so you're getting six of those. You're getting the tray, which actually pops it right into okay. the pot. You're also getting a little microwave omelet cooker and you're getting the egg timer. So that's really great too. So 12 to 13 minutes on the hard boiled, eight minutes on the poached. But let's just show you how you load these, okay? So you're just gonna take your egg and crack it directly into your egglet. Okay, now these are naturally going to be non-stick because they are silicone. They're also naturally BPA free, so you don't have to worry about any kind of chemicals. They're also dishwasher safe, so pop these into your top rack of your dishwasher. They're very easy, they're very convenient, they're very hard to find right now. So if this at all interests you, please go ahead and grab them before we sell them out. Then you just take the little lid and you screw it all the way to the top there. Now you can use the egglets without the tray or with the tray. I'm gonna show you both of those ways. But this is if you wanna do six at a time. Okay. So for me, I do a dozen a week. Okay. So I do this twice. And then you, all you do is you boil your water just like you would a traditional hard boiled egg. Okay. But you see, you've already removed the pain in the neck part of the hard yeah, boiled egg. Yeah, right. Because there's no shell. Pop it right into your boiling water. You boil it for 12 to 14 minutes. Okay. And then when it comes out, it is going to be a hard boiled egg sans shell. So you do not have to peel. All you do is take your egglet and you just twist off the top. Little tip, you can run a little spoon around it. Most of the time, it literally just squeezes out. Oh my God. Is that not the coolest situation? So rather than having this madness and this mess that you have over here, now you have a dozen, a half a dozen beautiful egglets that literally pops right out of that silicone that shell. So and you didn't neat. have to do any work. So if you know anybody that's maybe a little bit older, has dexterity issues, peeling eggs, they're gonna love these. And what you're seeing happening right there is simply an egglet being cooked in boiling water as your traditional egg would be cooked. But this time we've already removed the shell. So you can see the hot air or the hot water bubbles cooking that egg inside the silicone so that it is perfectly cooked every time. Now what's so cool about egglets is you can add spices and seasonings hot sauce, garlic, salt, salt, pepper, before you even cook your egg. Because who eats just a plain hard boiled egg? Most of us sprinkle a little salt or maybe a little garlic powder. Yeah. You can do that inside the egglet. You can also take a spoon like the kids or you know, grandparents, whoever, and eat right out of the egglet, especially if you do a little miniature omelet. Yes. You can take these to school, or if you're a teacher, or the kids can take them to right. school and eat from it with a spoon right, right out of the little especially egglet. Especially because there's a little lid on the top. And there's a lid, it has its own carry Yeah, case. because eggs are a great mm -hmm. sna little snack. So isn't that neat that you can do that? 
I love it. Who would have ever thunk it? <laughs> you somebody can, did, and somebody I wish I was. Some, because this is the hottest that might be item. On, that might be on a yacht right now. They're probably hanging out on a yacht somewhere. <laughs> At least I would be. So here's the trick to this, right? Here's you simply crack the egg and put it into the pot. Yep, and that's you can exactly cheat right. It. If you want to buy the stuff out of the supermarket, sure. you, you can do that too. The little egg beaters are great, or egg whites. You can do all egg white omelets. No shell, want, no peeling with this at all. But it cooks it perfectly, so I don't yes. want you to worry that it doesn't cook it perfectly. So you said approximately 12 to 14 12 minutes. 12 to 14 minutes on a hard-boiled egg. So there's your perfectly sliced hard-boiled egg. Maybe it's for a cob salad. You can see it is cooked to perfection, just as it would be a traditional egg. But this time, I haven't had to fight or fuss with a shell. I cannot tell you how many times and how many bad experiences I've had. Right. Maybe I'm doing deviled eggs, and I have to throw away a half a dozen eggs because half of them got peeled. Yes, you know, don't the we peel all know it, right? Off, and yeah. now you can do deviled eggs. And they literally, because they have that flat bottom, they're going to sit upright, which is really neat, too. So you can do your deviled egg stuffing, stuffing right there and have them sitting upright, just as we do right down here. Look how beautiful that is. So now you don't need a special hard uh, deviled egg tray. Now it can sit on any flat surface. By the way, we do include in some nice little recipes. So if you kind of are looking for some fun recipes for deviled eggs and that sort of thing, we include include that. Yep. Um, if you're wondering how to keep these clean, you can just wash these dishwasher with just warm, safe. Uh, warm soapy water yep. or put them on a top rack of the dishwasher to keep them. But Kelly mentioned to me that you, this is one of the hottest things out there. Uh, on her, she was saying how on social media, oh. everybody's talking about this. Sold we're, out. We're the only ones that have it. Yep. And this is the, the deluxe version. I'm glad to see what you're doing here because we don't just have to make hard boiled eggs. You can do poached There are soft. other ways yeah. of preparing the so eggs. So there's obviously a, a poached egg or a soft boiled egg and you can cook it as, you know, as little or as long as you like. So if you like a really uh, runny interior, you have complete control with the egglets when you pop them in. And the recipe guide tells you exactly what to do and how long. So if you want, yeah. soft boiled eggs is about seven to eight minutes. Hard boiled eggs is 12 to 14. A little hollandaise sauce and I just saved myself $34.95 at the all you can eat brunch where I always order the eggs benedict <laughs> because I never want to do my own poached eggs. It's a real pain in the neck. Now you can do it inside your egglet and you can also just do one or two. You can see right here in this pot, we didn't use the tray. So sometimes you can use the tray if you want to do all six, but I just have three floating around in here. So but you I can love do three that you, or, or I love one that it's or... so easy in that it makes it easy to store in the refrigerator. On yes. some of the video, yeah. we saw how they were right there just kind of on the side yep. door of the refrigerator. And so, you can take so, the lid off and eat right out of there. So here's the trick to this. You simply crack the egg and put it into the pot. Yep. You do that first. And as long as you crack the egg and put it into the pod first, you twist on the top and boil. And then 12 to 14 minutes later, voila. No peeling, no shell. <laughs> if you love to have Perfectly it. Perfectly cooked. Give us a call, $12.48. We are delighted to share this with you. I think that's the whole thing. I think we all have had an instance Everybody has. Oh, who hasn't had this situation happen We've in their all life? had it, right? What because peeling of the egg is, is really yeah. a chore. Yep. And half the time, you're right, you take half of the egg white yep. with it. Yep. So, and if you're making deviled eggs, I think we can all relate to what oh, you said. Well, you I end up I know, messing up most of them. I know people, Marlo, that quit offering to bring deviled eggs to the party because they didn't want to peel them anymore. Maybe they had arthritis or some kind of dexterity issue. They just didn't have any strength in their hand. You get tired of messing them up and messing yeah. your money up. Or they go to the grocery store and buy the deviled eggs, which, by the way, I've tried once when in a hurry, they have no flavor whatsoever. You don't want to do that. Remember, you're also getting, as basically a freebie, throwed in the omelet tray. You can do a three egg omelet. This took 60 seconds in the microwave. We did all of our toppings. You literally put it in the microwave and walk away. So your microwave egg ah. cooker is coming included so you can do those beautiful cheesy omelets. Oh, I like that. For sandwiches or on the go, eating healthy. And by the way, I don't know if I should remind folks, but I will. I'll get on my soapbox just for a hot minute. <laughs> Eggs are so incredibly healthy. Seven grams of protein for a large egg and at approximately seven cents for a large egg across the country on average. It's the most affordable protein you can buy for yourself or your family. Seven cents on average and seven grams of protein. Also, all of 13 essential amino acids and only 70 calories. When's the last time you had a snack that filled you up? that was only 70 calories. Never. It is quite possibly, <laughs> literally one of the world's perfect foods. Now, here's the other things that you can do and have fun with. These are little miniature omelets, okay? So all we did was scramble some eggs and put in our favorite toppings. 
Then we can just take egg whites if you want, or the egg beaters, omega eggs, any kind of eggs that you like or your family likes, or maybe there's six people coming over and everybody can make their own personal little omelet inside here. All you do is take the scrambled egg or the egg white or the egg beater, pour it inside your egglet, and then this just happens to be spinach or peppers. We've got some ham. You could grind some sausage, onions, scallion, goat cheese, whatever you want to do, salt, pepper, hot sauce, anything. The sky's the limit. And then this is using the tray, but of course you don't always have to use the tray. You could literally just do one if you wanted I to. I tell you what, Isn't if, that cool? if you're doing a lot of protein and, yep. you're, and you're looking to maybe lose, lose, couple, weight. lose weight, I would buy even more than one. Yeah. Because, I mean, how, how great like is to it? to do a dozen, yeah, a dozen at a time. Well, yeah, and especially with the free shipping and handling and the flex oh, yeah. pay, I think it helps because you're right. I think when we, it, that way you get variety. Yep. And I totally can relate to what Kelly mentioned. I mean, most of the time when we mess up on our program, it's because we're, we've gone too long without eating. And these will be at the ready in yep. your refrigerator. Yes. And you can have something really healthy and filling. And grabbing and, and, and satisfying and grabbing and going. And if you're doing the egg white, Marlo, it's only 20 calories per large egg. Oh, so you're talking 20 calories for a snack. This is a standard size pot, guys. I think this is our five gallon pot. So that's what the full six fits inside. Um, excuse me, five quart pot. Um, so you can see the full six. But if you're just doing one or two, you could use any size pot. I mean, I know folks that just want to do one or two and they'll free float on the inside there this animation I really like because it's not very often that we get to see what happens as a bag is boiling right so that boiling water is what hard boils your egg it hard cooks it or it soft cooks it so you can see it circulating around the egglet just like it would be circulating around an egg in the shell all you're doing is removing the problem child the shell that's the problem child right Gosh, I haven't had an egg salad in a long time I know is that recipes and <laughs> it comes with she's looking through the recipe book so nine you, recipes come included yeah. I like that. Yeah. This is a wonderful gift. It's a great tool if you guys are eating a lot of eggs in your home, mm -hmm. and I think most of us are. I was saying to Kelly, this weekend, there's no shorter of eggs that oh, we yeah. probably have around. You're going to have extra <laughs> eggs left over this from the Easter perfect. hunt or the dying. Look what you can do. That's just two fry oh, basically fried eggs or, you know, half um, you know, poached eggs on the inside there. You can do that in your microwave. That just came right out of the little, um, basically the little freebie that you're getting. So here at HSN is really the only place that's not on back order that you can get the deluxe set which includes the six egglets it includes the tray so that you can boil all six together it also includes the egg timer so and not only is it an egg timer it's a cute egg timer it's in the shape of an egg so you can set it for 12 minutes as you're hard boiling your egg and you can walk away knowing oh, safely that when that egg timer goes off I just pull these out I just set them down I let them cool and then I open them up and pop them out step and we've got kitchen essentials from your favorite brands that will be there for you whenever the inspiration for the perfect meal strikes like right now try this delicious twist on a classic combo What we love about origami, number one is we get the most incredible customer reviews off this product because it's so well made, because it solves so many different problems. Again, I was just talking about the Goldilocks size again. Yes. This is the perfect origami for everybody because first of all, anybody out there that has stuff, you know, the, the junk drawer, uh, you wanna put tools in here, you wanna put spices in here, heck, you can put uh, your fruit in here, whatever it is, this five tier storage drawer 
to me is one of the best that we carry. I love the furniture grade wood top on top. I love the colors that we have. And guess what? This lovely lady just put this together in 30 seconds. This That's is, all you need to do. This is my kind of work. This is, uh, yeah. Everybody loves something that comes completely assembled. Uh -huh. You saw all she did was put the drawers in. That's how it comes delivered to you. It has the wheels on the bottom. Today's price, here's what I'll tell you. We do not always get to put origami on free shipping. Right. Today, we were able to do that. So that's uh, $15 or $16. Uh, uh, and uh, we also put it on five flex, which you can get at home for less than $20. I love, this is, this is, uh, there's two that I love. I love the tall pantry rack. Uh -huh. And I love this one. Right. And this is our, this is the most drawers that we offer when it comes to our screen right. solution. This is our five drawer. Again, fully assembled. Drawers come in and out nice and easily. No tracks, nothing like that. You can see how, I mean, she put it together in a matter of seconds. Right. This is going to give you that extra workspace. It's going to give you that extra storage space. It's going to allow you to butt this right up to your countertop. So, sure. you know, there's no major movement from bringing something out of the oven to put on top of here but look at all of her cooking utensils are right there That's it's awesome. on wheels yeah so you just move it about but it's so great that you can use it in your office so you can have a, a complete storage system there with everything you need your papers great for the laundry room phenomenal for the bathroom i absolutely love it um we'll show it here in the closet you know so now you can actually have a drawer system in the closet it's going to be perfect underneath those hanging shirts yeah it's so ideal. you're going to have that drawer so, um solutions but we have all the colors which is yeah let's Huge Let's, well, because, right you know, we know that you're going to use this in a variety of ways. Some of you may want to use it in the laundry room, in the kitchen. Mm -hmm. if, if you've got a, uh, you know, a, you don't really have a pantry, but you have a closet where you'd like to put some canned right. goods, you know, you might want to match the colors. So Absolutely. we've got great colors. The turquoise is the one that's in, is that turquoise? Yes, this is turquoise right here. And remember, if you have origami at home, let's say you have our original kitchen cart <coughs> in turquoise, right. all of this matches. So as we go through the colors, remember that as well. So here's the five drawer in the turquoise. Look at how gorgeous it is next to that beautiful light yellow. That's one of our newer yeah, colors right here. I like right that here. color, I like the yellow. I do too. Now remember, yep. it's all powder coated steel too, that steel frame. Um, this is our black. So you've got that matte black with the mm -hmm. furniture grade wood top, red, Number one accent color when it comes I to love, the kitchen. I love you got your bakeware in there. Everything's right yeah, here. Look at and it's so the top shelf is so strong. It holds 22 pounds worth of weight. So this can be your baking station. You can have your flours, your sugars, you can have all of your sprinkle, right. whatever you need. It's right here. Uh, vintage bronze, which is a huge customer pick. This is a very rich, rich bronze. And when you get it home, you'll notice there'll be little specks of gold in there as yeah. well. So again, a very rich. But look at this is your Where coffee you, station. I can move it. Move it around with one hand. Right. Everything you need is right here. You've got your pods, you've got your cups, you've got your teas. Think, think about too, if you need something like this in your workplace, because we get yeah. a ton of people that use this in the industrial world or whatever. We get people that put, bring these to their storage mm -hmm. facilities because they can store stuff. But like if you have a little, a little office or whatever and you would love a coffee station. Right. Do it yourself. Exactly. This comes in the box completely assembled. All you do is put the drawers in. That's it. Yeah. And if you want to add the wheels, you can mm -hmm. add the wheels. So some people use it permanent so they don't put the wheels on. I like the wheels on. I do Because I like to clean well, behind it and all and that. I clean behind it and I'm always ch changing my mind. I imagine me Not changing you, my mind. Not you, Tracy Rosa. But like one, one you know, month or a couple months, I'll use it for one thing sure. or a holiday will change and I'll use yeah. it for something else or it's nice outside so I can take it outside. It may, out, it may outgrow its use in one area. Yes. And then you want to put it here. I, I love it too in a, in a, in a, in a powder room or your, or your laundry room for storing things like towels and washcloths and soaps and yes. even extra backup toilet paper shampoo whatever it is it'll all fit inside yes. there this is silver and then right next to you is white so those yeah. are all the colors this white one does not have a white top this is actually our cutting board that right. we have too so think of picking that up as well because we yeah um, uh, do we have that available kyle the cutting board we're going to check. Anyway, it's, right. a, it's a loose light material kind of a cutting board, and it fits right over the wood top. And what's nice about this is, and, and I know it's hard for you to see there. I'll kind of lift it. I don't know if you can get close to my hands there, Mike. And you'll see this is actually a top that goes over the wood top, locks on, and now you've got a, a, you know, a cleanable sanitizable yes. top so you could chop on this thing. Yeah, and then you're a big griller. We're big grillers at home as well, so this is a nice little option yep. to have this right by the grill and then you're able to cut all your... We have the item thing. number for that, by the way. It's 529-967 if you want the um, the cart cutting board. Just ask for that if you're also ordering or check it out on .com. Yeah. Look at how much you have inside here. Yeah, so this, here. Is, this is about capacity. You know, yeah. here's the deal with these. You've got the three bottom drawers here are these really thick, strong um, metal drawers, okay? Each one is going to hold eight pounds worth of weight. So check this out. I mean, this is a good size drawer. I love that.
love the fact that these drawers actually come out of the cart because a lot of times these carts have stoppers on where you can't take the entire drawer out. I love that option. But imagine, you know, we've got a ton of fruit right here. The fruit's great in these because this is all aerated. You can see exactly what you get, but you can see that those little, um, the little holes in here, the mesh, it's not too big, guys. So stuff's not going to fall through there. So you can put lots of, you know, little toys in here. You can right. put, uh, if you're a crafter, this is great because I've learned that in crafting, there are no large pieces, especially like scrapbooking. Like the pieces are eensy teensy, you know? And yeah, so yeah, what yeah. do you do with those once you open the bags and stuff? This is storage. The other day on Facebook, there's a Facebook page called HSN Fanatics. It's a bunch of people who love, uh, write all the things that they love. Right. They did a poll to see what they use this cart for. Universal, every single person who comment, makeup cart. Yeah. I mean, it makes sense. Right. You know, well, you could because, and you have a lot, you know, with makeup, you have so many different things you like yes. to utilize. And you never, one drawer is never enough. So what's nice about this is we have five built in mm -hmm. drawers. Um, I'm a, you know, I like to do stuff in the kitchen. So I can't tell you how many funky little weird like utensils and knives yes. and, and tongs and garlic press. I have so much stuff and I would never be able to get it into one or two drawers and that's where this comes absolutely perfect. If you need to store canned goods, if you've got a closet that maybe you, you know you want to put uh, you know your, your, your cans of soup and your emergency kits and all that stuff, you can do that. Med medical supplies. I mean literally you can use it for anything. We get people that buy three of these and bring it to their storage unit and they put mm -hmm. stuff in there. But the nice thing like I said is, is realistic. It's the way it's made. The quality of which is made. It's a very, very solid piece. And the fact that when you get it, all you do is open it and put the, the shelves in. You know, I bought a shelving system when I moved to Florida. Uh, my house doesn't have, a, it has an attic, but you know, I'll never ever go up there and you couldn't pay me enough money to walk up into that attic. Um, <laughs> it's just scary up there. So I, I bought a shed, one of those uh -huh. prefab sheds and I brought it out. And one of the first things I did is I bought a, pl a plastic system to put in there. And within a year here in the Florida heat, the whole thing started to kind of melt and turn right. to the side. There was mold growing on the bottom of it because plastic can harbor mm -hmm. mold. What's nice about this powder coated steel is it's resistant to all that. You can have this outside. If you want to have this as a barbecue cart, you can yeah. put this next to your grill. In fact, I don't know if we sell, we sell covers for this. I think we might. If not, you can find a cover anywhere to fit it, but you don't need to. These things are these things are fine to keep right. outside. Well, speaking of me melting, you know, when you were talking a minute ago about right. your storage, I mean, I've I've made the mistake of having um, one of those plastic storage containers in the um, bathroom, which is never yeah. a good thing. And I put a curling iron away that wasn't cooled yeah, off all the way. So remember, you know, it's, I think it's hard to find something for the bathroom because you're dealing with steam and humidity and, and hot, you know, stuff right. and a uh, um, million hair and makeup things. This is that perfect solution. Great, great footprint. We're talking a little bit about a foot and a half all the way around. Each one of these drawers holds eight pounds worth of weight. You've got that strong mesh finish right here. Mm -hmm. Okay. Notice when I take these off, there are no wheels or no tracks right here. So right in here. So you know when you have like a system that has a wheel oh or my plastic. Gosh. My dresser and, drawer has a wheel yeah. system and I, and I, and have to, like I have to pull them out and <laughs> tighten the little, the little wheel thing on it. Yeah. And it's a nice nightmare to get in. There's a little hole where the wheel has to go in the track. I'm like, why'd they do that? I know. This is so much easier Super because it's easy. metal on metal. There's mm -hmm. nothing. There's no little pieces that can fall or break. And w watch this. This is my favorite part. So you get the box. That's what's in the box. Yeah, They're so it. smart over there, aren't they? It is. You know, yeah. and, I mean, how many times have you opened up a storage system and you see like five sheets of metal or five different things that you're going to have to personally attach. They give you, a, a you know, a, yeah. one little tool. Then you've got a million instructions. You've got a baggie full of nuts and bolts and all of that. Sure. Literally, you put the top on. This is what we do. We put the top on. There's that little peg right here that's going to marry into the little holes that are on the top of this, okay? Yep. So now that secures the entire system in place. You're getting five drawers. So let's take a look at these drawers. Here's the fun thing. They all nest like this. Mm -hmm. So if you have to store them, if you want to break this down and move it about, yeah, it's, if you move, yeah, it's right. literally going to be like storing just <coughs> one drawer. But you can see that they slide in nice and easy. There's nothing to worry about. You've got the great little handles they don't, right here. They'll never warp. Nope, nope. nope. Nice and, and you'll have two smaller drawers on top. I like that option because I, you know, you store sometimes in junk drawers, what you store smaller things like pencils or tapes or scissors or something like that. You may not want to load like a heavy duty drawer with stuff like that. But these drawers are strong enough. You can get a ton of, um, this could be your pantry. You could have yeah. all your canned goods here, your spices, you know, your soups, everything can be right here. And there you go, nice and easy. It takes a matter of seconds. Well, let's just talk about entertaining for a second. I mean, yeah. you're a big barbecue guy. I'm a barbecue girl, you is. know. You go outside 
And now you're not running back and forth from inside of the house. You can right. have all of your cooking utensils right here, your condiments right here, extra plates right here, and then you just set this up to the bar, uh, up to the barbecue, and now you have an extra table. Yeah. You know, when you barbecue, you have to have a table next to you. Yeah, you know, I mean, you, most people don't have the little fold-out little right. thing that comes off your grill, but yeah. even that, you can't move that. No. What's nice about this, and, and honestly, also, you know what? I, I want to I emphasize this, too. If you do get the, the cutting board top, which I think you should get, um, even if you're taking this, this is, happens to be at a good height for yes. bringing to and from mm -hmm. the oven. So if I, we don't have a, well, we got one back there. But anyway, I don't know if you can see me over there. Can I walk it over there really quick? You guys will get me, right? Watch. <laughs> so we're just going to follow me. So if I had a turkey in the oven. Right. All right? And you know how dangerous it is trying to get that turkey out of the oven, especially if you're by yourself. Of maybe, maybe you're, a, you know, you're a woman living alone, and you got this giant turkey and nobody to help you. Right. You know, you're, you're single, you're, you know, you're a college kid, whatever. You're living in an apartment. You take the turkey out, boom, and you can put the turkey right. there, and then you can roll the turkey. Right. And, and you then can the bring, turkey stays there. Stays there. So now you're not yeah. picking it up again right. and putting it on the table. I so know. now you have that yeah. serving station. How about a, you know? I always I'm surprised you haven't brought this up yet, but this could also be your little portable bar cart. I was getting there. <laughs> I just I messed with Tracy. There. Now, now listen, I you make fun, Tracy. yeah. But let me tell you, a little birdie myself yeah. um, has proven that you can get on the bottom shelves four bottles of wine yeah. in each one of those drawers. It still glides in nice, nice and I love easily, it. whether it's little, red or white. Wine rack, perfect wine for rack, that. yes. I, honestly, you know, the nice thing is it can wear so many different hats, and that's what's great about origami. It's what you want it to be. Here we're showing you a laundry cart. Here we're showing it to stack your and store your shoes. Mm -hmm. um, you could uh, keep this right at, the, at the, you know, the entryway, and people could put whatever it is they need to put in there, you know, your kids' stuff. Uh, junk drawers, if your kids have DVDs, if they have Xbox, if they have mm. a Wii or whatever it is they have. Even Legos. They got all these little games. Even Legos. Yeah. I mean, like anything that has like small pieces, you know, puzzle pieces, all of that, you yeah. know, this is a great storage solution. We're going to go to our phones. We're going to go out yeah. to the beautiful state of Illinois. We're going to say hi to Deborah, who's going to tell us a little bit about her experience with origami. Good morning, Deborah. Welcome. Good morning. Hey, I just love origami. I bought one piece last year. Yeah? And I'm hooked. <laughs> <laughs> Tell us I why. Have, why you love it. I have three of the kitchen carts. Yeah. Wow. I have one in the kitchen with vegetables and extra utensils. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I have one in my office with my printer and all of my office supplies. Perfect. And I have one in the basement with all my sewing needs next it's to my good. sewing machine. I would say, you know, across the board, almost every single host here has some kind of origami. Not because we get it at a discount, it has nothing, no. to, it's because it, wor it works. Because, you know, even if you get a discount, if something doesn't work, you're just gonna get rid of it in six months or a year, and then you're back to buying something else. Right, right. Get and, something that works. And just think of, you know, I, I love how she said, if you buy one, you get more. It's kind of like potato chips. Yeah, you yeah, know, yeah. you come back for more. Here's the thing, stop. if you think of everything just in this hour alone, your teas, your ginger, your pots, your pans, your, your even the cupcake maker, the yeah. treat makers, you need a place to store that stuff. Because right. what happens is you come home and it usually goes in a pantry or or in a cabinet, and right. then you forget about it. You totally. don't use it. Yeah, I know. And now you have that perfect storage solution in any color. What you want to do is recreate the manufacturer's original seal. That's the one they put on there in the first place. And I'm going to show you how this works, the way it works in just a second. But just to warm you up a little bit, have a look, guys. Listen, we're getting into the summer months down in Florida. When yeah. you open that bag of chips, yeah. you have 17 minutes to finish it <laughs> the most. or it's all over. <laughs> so let me show you how this works, you guys. It's brilliant and it's very well named as the smart sealer. Now, this is a clamshell design, which is very cool. And I'm going to take you back to grade one science class. A little bit of positive side plus a little bit of negative side equals a little bit of heat. And that really is that simple, you guys. That's what recreates that seal on the inside. Now, we've packed it with features, too. First and foremost, the free batteries that come with it. There's going to be a guard so it doesn't connect, so you don't have to worry about wasting the batteries. There is an on-off button right there, but it's automatic. You never have to worry about it. Now, let me turn this over. There's a magnet there so it can live on the fridge of the backsplash. And if you have trouble with those clamshell packages, well, that's in there, too. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. You love, love it. You need. I just want and to show colors. you colors. Red Witch's art is because Mark's been demonstrating on it, is the number one seller right now. But we also have the blue, we have green, there's aqua and plum, and of course that classic black. Just to reiterate, you do get two 
complete sets, which includes the batteries, and we're including 20 of the food grade bags as well. When you start to open your mind to oh, what you use this for, it is a daily occurrence. Well, listen, as families, we throw out three, four hundred bucks a year in food. Here's here's every morning in my house, a 14 year old <laughs> pours his cereal puts it back in the counter and walks off. That turns this into the most expensive meal of the day. Watch this, you guys. In 100 years, you're not gonna let your kids use the two, three, four, five hundred dollar sealers that you've bought in your kitchen, but watch this. Everybody can use this. And Adam, the best part is, and I haven't even mentioned it yet. Say it. You're not married to my company forever. I'm not gonna make you buy my bags. You bought a bag. Your food came in it. Use that. You already paid for it. And people always ask me, is the seal that good? Guys, I said it at the top of the show. There are needs in the kitchen, there are wants in the kitchen. Right. I got a lot of stuff that I want in my kitchen, right. but a sealer I need. Because the bottom line is, I got a family of four, I go through the food, we all work hard for our money, and the last thing any of us are gonna do is reach into our pocket, grab a 50, 20, 100, whatever it is, crumple it up into a ball, and throw it in the crash can. But every single time you throw something in the cupboard without checking it, that it's sealed, or sealing it yourself, that's what happens, you guys. And this is a live demonstration, Love so this it. isn't like it's being pre -produced. You're seeing the smart sealer work before your very eyes. The joy of this is that it really is, it, it's so small, it's so convenient, it fits in the kitchen drawer, uh, and it's no hassle. So you're not exactly. replacing anything or adding anything other than batteries. And let me tell you, this uses such little of the battery that the batteries will last hundreds for a long time. Hundreds and hundreds of seals uh, per battery change. And Absolutely. And that's why for the value, for less than $20, it's worth it. But again, don't take our word for it. Online at hsn.com, the reviews are very, very compelling and very, very strong. Strong. Love Red love will it. be the first to sell out, followed by the plum, if that's the one you'd like. What's next, Mark? Well, here you go. What's your method here? Do you spin? Do you flip? Is it a clothespin? Yeah. Is it a staple gun? What are you using here? Bottom line is you're still throwing bread out, okay? <laughs> so instead of all that stuff, go ahead and grab this guy, which on the magnet is already available to you on the side of your fridge or on the, your, your backsplash, because it'll live outside of your junk drawer, which is really important. And guys, just go ahead and go center to center, side to side. There's no rules. I really don't care what you do. I'll all I really care that you do is seal that bag. Doesn't have to be pretty, doesn't have to be perfect, it just has to be sealed. And Adam, when we can keep the moisture away, when we can keep the bugs away, when we can keep all of that stuff away, our food lasts a little longer. Let's be honest, Which all right? Which is what we want. That's gonna exactly. save us some money in the long term. It's a an easy, easy step. It takes no time and no hassle at all. I think a lot of us have seen other food sealers out there that are big devices, big gadgets. This is small and handy, and it also, by the way, makes a great little gift for somebody as well. Mark, where did you go? Where's I'm Mark? over here, man. I'm, I'm, oh, very, I'm very stealthy, I blend. <laughs> Guys, look at this. Remember what I told you about the magnets? How cool is this? I mean, this is a great idea. What good is the greatest gadget you ever had if you can't find it? Right. So you're gonna get two. Feel free, keep one at work, keep one in the car, keep one while you're camping, right? That's really, really important, and by the way, especially when you're at work to keep in your office desk because, you, you know, well, listen, we're long past giving up on our New Year's resolutions. Those are long gone. But here's the deal, all right? You buy one of those little bags of chips that are supposedly two or three servings, you eat them because you opened them. Sure. Right? Now you can seal them up. In fact, have a look here, guys. Here's some different ideas for you, okay? And I grabbed this out of the freezer. This is a big one. Every single time you open and close a freezer door, you exchange hot air for cold. Right. That's where all the frost comes from. So these are a big one. If you're like me, you grab your five or six waffles for, uh, for breakfast, and then what happens is the kids throw these back in the freezer and you end up with a couple of little snowy discs in about two weeks that you have to How throw out. How true is that? Right? Take two seconds, you guys. That's all you need to do. You hold it together for three seconds to warm it up, run it across, and that's it. That lasts a little bit longer. Now, if you want to have some fun, take a bag this size and walk it over to your sealer. It's going to run for its life. Okay? <laughs> the bigger the bag, the better for the smart sealer because there's no other type of sealer in the world that's going to go ahead and take care of that for you. So watch this, you guys, and I love this. Thick bags, thin bags, foil lined bags, it doesn't matter, okay? You control the speed, you control the pressure. It doesn't have to be pretty, doesn't have to be perfect, it just has to be sealed. Look at this. We also don't care what angle that bag is cut on, all right? If you've got larger bags, you just wanna take it down the side, that's fine, and by the way, this is pet food and plant food. Right. You're pets and your plants love fresh food as much as you do. So go out into the garage where you're storing that stuff before all the other critters that you don't name crawl around in it and get it sealed. And here, last but not least, uh, hair care is a real problem when I travel and all of my <laughs> products go all over the suitcase. So we're gonna give you those 20 bags and here's a great use for them, okay? If you travel like I do, take a second, pop anything that might you know explode under pressure in that bag, seal it up, and then you don't have to worry about it in the plane. Just a couple of quick little ideas 
you'll find use after use after use for your smart seal, including that smart? spider. There we go. <laughs> a real spider? <laughs> nice. Gone. I didn't even see that. Um, guys, if you're looking to order in that beautiful uh, lime green as well, which is one of the newer colors, that is also now in the lead. Uh, that with the red, those two seem to be neck and neck, followed by that plum. I do think that classic black as well, if you want to get it as a gift for somebody, you get two of them. Uh, Mark, why two? Why do I need two? Well, uh, uh, that's... That, Buy I was, one, I was, one. I was looking at lettuce. <laughs> Listen, they're small enough that you can keep in different places. I love throwing one in the, in the camper. Uh, we all have one in our office at work. Uh, we've got one in the car. Bottom line is, guys, you open food no matter where you are. You stop at a convenience store, you open your bag of lunch, you do this, you do that. Yeah. And if you don't seal it properly, you will throw it out. Like I said, if you're in one of these damper uh, states like we are here, oh boy, yeah. you have minutes. And here's a good one. Listen, we all want to save a little money going out to the restaurants by doing stuff at home, okay? So we go and we buy these pre-things, uh, you know, sure. pre-cut things of salad. And if you don't seal this up right away in the fridge, and we've all tried our best way, we all know it starts to turn brown. And if you're only getting one bowl of lettuce out of this, go to the five-star restaurant, man. You'll be further ahead. Take two seconds. Watch this. One 1,000, two 1,000, three 1,000. There's your, there's your user manual. I mean, that's it. That's what heats it up, you guys. You can start in the middle. You can start in the end. I prefer to start in the middle because I know exactly where I left off. Now, that next bowl of salad, the one that's actually going to start saving me some money, is tucked right inside. And this was a big one for me. I moved here from Canada, right, yeah. Yeah, about 10 years ago. And I remember, uh, you know, uh, like rice and beans and anything that you already think is already dry. Yeah. I have a little test for you. Take the lid off that rice or flour for a couple of weeks. Huh? You ever seen Pepper Walk? <laughs> Watch this, you guys. Guys, we're going to go to the phones as well because, if I know, we're going to go to Skype because my insider, Krista, is standing All by. Right. We send Krista a set of the smart sealers. Krista, you with Mark and Adam. How are you doing hey. on this Monday night? Hi, Adam. Hi, Mark. Hi there. Krista, talk to us. What do you think to the smart sealer? Oh, I absolutely love it. I've been using it all around the kitchen. I have three kids that hey. constantly <laughs> leave cereal open, and it just goes to waste. Not anymore. <laughs> Now, Krista, people always think when they see Mark doing this on TV that it can't possibly be as easy as Mark's showing it to be. Is it that simple? Oh, it is super simple. It is just, just like he shows. You just warm it up for the few seconds and then slide it across and it's sealed. So have you found, Krista, that you're now using it on everything? Because like, I, for most of us, when we watch this presentation, we have a couple ideas. The potato chip bag, for example, always gets folks. But you could use it on anything, right? Oh, yes. I, I found I'm a crafter. So I find glitter gets everywhere. So I just pop a little container of glitter down in a bag and seal it, and I don't have glitter in all of my things. I have a 10-year-old. I have glitter on me now. <laughs> <laughs> and he's proud. He's on his eyes. Uh, guys, thank you so much, Krista. We appreciate you. Thank you for taking it uh, for a test drive. With that in mind, folks, thank we're you, busy, Adam. busy, busy. We have a lot of folks dialing in, so we might as well go to Darlene in New York. Darlene, welcome to the Monday Night Show. How is your Monday going? Oh, fine. No, this is on. I buy this all the time, and uh, I buy it for all my kids, uh, my grandkids, but mine sort of walked out the door. I can't find it. That's what I do. I can't do without it. Dolly, why? Why do you love it so much? Because I have grandkids that leave things open, and right. I have taught them to, uh, they know how to use it. I've taught them how to seal up their cereal, their candy, their M&Ms, mm -hmm. whatever. And uh, like I said, mine walked out the door this weekend when they were here, so I kind of have one. <laughs> <laughs> Jolly, do you think you've saved money with the smart sealer? I saved a ton of money. I also saved money on, on uh, bags because I could take a used plastic bag, sure. and if the seal doesn't work on top, I put my meat or whatever it is, and I seal it with this. Uh, so, uh, 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 such a valid point, and a lot of people say the exact same thing if you read reviews online. Thank you, Darlene, for taking the time to speak to us. Mark, thank you, my Thank friend. you, sir. The easy hold is the absolute one and done perfect answer for you today. Now we are down to our final quantities on this guy. We've sold literally hundreds of thousands of these genius solutions that come with the little lemon squeezer that's right on the, uh, the hand protector, but we're down to our final colors. Our red is gone, our black is gone. If you want it, I've got purple, I've got green, and I've got blue 
final supplies, so we're doing free shipping and we're doing four flexible payments for less than $9, which is probably what that fancy cooking store wants to charge you for one attachment. Right. Own all the different slices, all the different cuts without ever hurting your fingertips, without ever hurting your knuckles, and get everything prepped that you need to get prepped, perfectly sliced, perfectly diced, perfectly cut, over and over and over again. It's so simple, too, because everything is all in one. Yep. There's no parts and pieces. You have the mandolin with the two knobs. You've got a knob on either side. And let me just show you how this works because the, the design on this is just amazing. You've got feet on the bottom, okay, that are kind of in a U shape. And those feet are designed to fit over any size salad bowl, a frying pan, a soup pot, or you can stand it up on your countertop or tabletop. It has a handle, so whether you're right-handed or left-handed, here's the best part, this little safety holder. Because if you've ever slipped on one of those tool, kitchen tools that, you know, they don't give you anything to protect your fingers, yep. <laughs> right? Uh, you get down close to the end and you end up wasting a big chunk of food or you end up wearing one of these things. <laughs> so <laughs> this little safety holder, the way it works, there's four stainless steel steel pins inside a free-flowing plunger on top. So you take your vegetable fruit meat or cheese, you place it inside on those prongs, and now this holds your food, you hold the holder, and the mandolin does the work for you. It's got a razor-sharp German stainless steel blade. That's what does all the work, and you see how there's never any waste? It takes it right down to the last slice, so with no waste and no fingers, you get perfect slices. Things like pan fries, home fries, or raw fries, cottage fries, American fries, whatever you want to call them, they'll all fry up even if they're all sliced even, right? And I want you to look at these slices. Every one is just like the last. So it's not like a knife where you get one thick slice, one thin slice, one finger slice <laughs> sometimes. <laughs> but here's the thing. There's eight different slicing thicknesses. Now, the knob on this side adjusts the, uh, the thickness of your slice. So it's got eight different notches or eight different clicks, okay? And it's all labeled right here on the side of the machine. So I'm going to go from the thick slice up to a thinner slice. And you'll love this for things like making homemade bread and butter pickles, or nickeling down carrots for canning, or slicing beets for pickling, uh, cucumbers for cucumber and onion salad. And then when you get down close to your fingers, you have your safety holder, so now you can't even cut yourself if you slip. Your fingers are always protected. You know, John, that button feeds it down to the end. Doesn't it just make sense? You know what I think is, <laughs> it, you know, I think because it's got this cute design to it, because it's a smaller footprint, y'all think this is a gimmick, right? You think it's a little Chinese made, it's got a thin little bit. These are made in Germany. Made in Germany, yeah. That is German steel. We are talking about the same type of steel, the same country that's making your hundred-dollar <laughs> knives. Right. And you get this easy-to-use, multi-function, multi-cut, multi-design perfect choice to own without 17 attachments and not a $200 <laughs> bill, and yet it's still German steel. That's why customers have fallen in love with this product. That's why it's the only ones they're using in their home. It's why it's the only one I'm using, and it's why John can truly just keep slicing and dicing away regardless of what he's cutting. Look at this, now, onions. If you want blue, last call, 800 left to go around, <laughs> over 1,200 now ordered. Again, we're not limiting quantities with that special flex. It's $8.75, so one for your house, one for your sister's house, one is a host gift to whoever's constantly cutting and serving for you. It really, I mean, look at the slice he's I doing know. now. Totally well, different. Here, this is actually what mandolins were originally made for in Germany. They were made as a cabbage board for shredding cabbage for sauerkraut. Mm -hmm. You'll love it for long, stringy coleslaw. You can make hot slaw, pepper slaw, chow chow. Hey, you'll, on, on taco night, Take a head of lettuce. You, you know, you can adjust the thickness so you don't have to come out so paper thin like this. You can actually, or maybe you want cabbage a little thicker for like noodles and cabbage. Or, you know, for iceberg lettuce on taco night, you get that nice thick shred like that. So it's a totally adjustable machine. But here's the thing. I always say if the only thing you ever use it for is onions, it's worth it for the onions. But watch this because I'm gonna put it to a medium slice and then I'm gonna raise these teeth up. Now it's got large teeth, it's got small teeth, and it's got medium teeth, okay? And the reason is sometimes you want big French fries, sometimes you want little French fries, sometimes, <laughs> sometimes, here, look at this. Sometimes you want those the, that angel haircut. Now look at this. I just made shoestring French fries <laughs> in that literally seconds. That was an entire seconds. potato if in that's maybe the three seconds. Only thing you use it for. It, it's worth it just for French fries. But I always say too, it, you don't have to use this machine for everything that we show you here. If you just use it for this one job, just for mincing onions. I mean, <laughs> the tears we all shed mincing onions with knives. You know, you play tic tac toe with a knife on an onion. Look at this. 
perfect minced onions for tuna fish, for chicken salad, for homemade meatloaf on taco Ooh, night, on taco for homemade chili. chili. Yeah. Oh, it's amazing. Now you're and talking my language. It just saves you so much time. And that's why every professional chef in the world has a mandolin in their arsenal of kitchen tools because it saves so much time. Yeah, except they spend just $200 like, on theirs. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, the thing is, uh, the time that you spend, uh, think about celery. Now, you could do one stock at a time if you want, okay? But I like to get the job done fast. I'll grab the whole bunch like this and just brush it through the blades. You can chop more celery in 10 seconds with this machine than you could chop in 10 minutes with a knife. Hey, for tuna fish, chicken salad, for homemade stuffing come the holidays. And the thing is, there's 26 different ways just to cut celery with the machine. I'm telling you, he, he cuts so many onions so fast, now my eyes are watering from it. That's how powerful it is. There's literally like three onions in the air right now. I mean, I, I, I love this little mandolin, but not so much that it makes me cry. But you, you will love it yep. when you realize you're saving your fingers, you're saving every last little bit of food, and the cut are perfect every single time. Taco night is now a breeze. Right. Homemade tuna salad with, with chopped uh, celery in it. Uh, prepping and preparing for, for stir fry, for crudite. All of it with a genius multifunction product that doesn't cost hundreds of dollars, that doesn't involve buying a la carte pieces that you have to find a way to store. That's why we love this little guy so much. That's why your fellow customers have bought it up in droves. And when you know what's inside of it is German steel and yeah. German engineering, that shows you that you really are getting the same quality quality of technology that a $200 mandolin would cost, all you do is choose your color with us today. Four flex, free shipping while we have supplies available for you. Uh, in the blue color, we are down to our final supplies. That one will sell out during this airing alone. It'll be followed by the green. Last in stock will be the purple. But at the end of the day, color schmuller. It's about what it can do for you. Right. you know, you're saving all of your produce with Debbie Meyer green boxes. They're staying fresher longer, and now it's time to serve them. Well, you don't just serve them in their whole form. Cut them up better. In fact, when you cut them up this way, you could even put what's cut up back in a Debbie Meyer green box and have it last longer. This really is empowering you to fresh cooking in the new year, to healthier eating in the new year. It's every great tool you need to get it done. And also, oh, I don't know, save your fingers and your knuckles while you're at it. Yeah, it just saves so much time. I mean, take a bell pepper, brush it through the blade like this, this. And again, that German stainless steel blade does the work. Now, if that's too thick, okay, if you want it thinner than that, I mean, these are great for a salad. Uh, but if you like it maybe for a sub or for uh, 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 onions and... Uh, you know, peppers and onions. All you do is turn the knob, and look at this. I can make this so thin. Here, we'll make it super thin like this. Paper thin slices, they each come out perfect, and you don't waste anything. It takes it right down to the very last piece, but look at how paper thin these slices come out, and they're all identical. So they're perfect for salads, for sandwiches, or, for soups or stews. I mean, if you want to dice that, now all you do is pop the teeth up. Now, I mentioned those larger teeth earlier for bigger french fries, bigger carrot sticks. All you do is take a potato, brush it through the blades, and look at this. I mean, right? <laughs> you don't even, you could make a bucket load of these. You could feed your whole neighborhood you li with this machine. You literally could and feed an <laughs> army. We should be sending these all out to every single army chef, every military cook there is out in the entire world. <laughs> Quicker, and safer, better. Hey, will you do me a favor? Yeah. I love what this can do with corn. Yeah. And since I've got I a two-year-old at home right now, it's such a necessary product because to own. Because we've shown you the slicing, the dicing, the chopping, the mincing, the shredding. It, it does everything but the cooking. It'll even take corn off the cob four or five rows at a time. Just put it on the thick slice, hold it off to the side like this and brush it through. It takes four or five rows of corn off the cob. If you've ever tried to do this, by, you know, with a knife, <laughs> how the corn kernels fly all over the kitchen and you get more cob, you know, cob in the corn and everything else. Look at that. There's nothing there but corn kernels. It's perfect whether it's blanched corn, cooked corn, raw corn. And then we even put ridges on the side of the machine like this. I like to use those ridges to milk the cob for your cream style corn, for your corn succotash, relishes and corn chowder. I mean, that way you get all the goodness off the cob, you don't waste anything. <laughs> I mean, mm -hmm. just as a corn stripper, though, it's I, I, if that's all you used it for, it's oh, worth it. And by the way, there's a free little juicer built in. They didn't waste a single no. <laughs> uh, a single inch of real oh, yeah. estate. What you grip the top with is actually that safety holder a citrus doubles juicer. Doubles as a citrus juicer. Genius. So you take a half an, an orange, a lemon, a lime, or a grapefruit, twist it over the top, and it even comes with this pour spout. So you take this to your kitchen glass. Here, I'll bring this into. Look at this. You take it to your fruit. Uh, your fruit fruit juice glass and pour it right in.
That way you don't waste a drop. So <laughs> on FlexPay for literally less than the price of one attachment piece for that super fancy one they wanted at the fancy oh, cooking yeah. store at the mall. Let us How pay for this? the food you're gonna cut with it and let us give you the best tool you'll ever use over and over and over again with real fine German steel. How about this? Now, it's last call by the way, if you want blue, this is your chance to do it, okay? If you want blue, there's now maybe 500 of these left. I know there's a lot of you in line right now. HSN.com is a fast way to get your color. Express ordering allows you to choose your color. Express ordering lets you do FlexPay on .com or our mobile app. You can get in without waiting. This is our first big sale of the year. We're doing our biggest and best offers in the kitchen today. So keep shopping while you can. We thank you for your patience for those of you who are new shoppers shopping with us for the first time. But if you're new with us, you've never seen this product before, take a second or two and take a glance at it because truly, at the end of the day, it so rings. outpaces products you've paid two, three, oh, four yeah. times the price for. I mean, th and think all the things that now you can do with this. I mean, making homemade onion rings now. Just dip these in the batter, into the hot oil, you're done. Or here, we'll, we'll go to the thinnest slice. Watch what I'm gonna do, because if you have kids that love potato chips, or maybe you do, all right, put a potato in the safety holder, and look at this. You can make homemade potato chips so fast, so safe, so simple, and again, you're not wasting anything. I want you to look at these potato chips though because they're wow, <laughs> you they're spread thin. these out on a cookie sheet in the oven you can sprinkle some parmesan cheese or barbecue salt over the top they're delicious baked instead of deep fried and they're better for you too so i mean you can put it in an air fryer you can put them in a, in a deep fryer if you like but oh, it you, does way more you, work you see, you see what's happening a little bit later <laughs> don't you air fryers coming <laughs> oh, up yeah? by the way air fryers coming up at a hundred dollars off so it buys you the way you slice and prep <laughs> to put it in the air fryer I mean, even your fruits. Hey, how about uh, making a sangria? You can take your lemon, a lime, an orange. All you do is brush it. Whoop, that one. <laughs> Sometimes I feel like that sweet. Oh, who was that Swedish chef on the Muppets? <laughs> you know, he threw food everywhere. Look at this. All you do is brush it against that blade. The safety holder, again, see how that safety holder feeds it down through there so you never waste anything? How about, the, oh, here's some fun stuff. Try some different types of fruits, like this uh, dragon fruit. They're beautiful, they're delicious, and now, they're easy to cut because you've got that mandolin. You get those uniform slices. Each slice comes out exactly the same thickness. So, and I mean, it, the things like star fruit, the kids love these things. Look okay, at this, so now you can do it. Ladies and gentlemen, just a quick heads up here. 1,800 sold, clock is down right now, and it is our final call on the blue. If you want blue available to be in your kitchen, in your drawer, in your RV, uh, there's now less than 500 of those still available as we process your orders. We've got green for about six, 700 of you and about 1,000 left in purple. Up. And tonight, we will set you up with your new favorite kitchen tool. You will fall in love with these items from the best brands in cookware. Plus, these deals might be sweet, but it gets sweeter with the HSN credit card. You'll get extra flex, VIP financing, and there's no annual fee. Imagine having a portable oven. Wherever you go, you actually can cook your meal, you can keep it hot, you can actually be in the office and plug it in, go to a meeting and come back, and now it's a homemade meal that tastes great. That's the exciting thing about Hot Logic, and we got great colors, but it is a personal, portable oven. How cool is this? Now we launched it back in February and it sold out like in two airings. It's finally back tonight. Please notice too, we have four flex pays and that's only for right now. What's flex? Well, you pay it off in four months. Right now it's $10 to get it at home. And then if you want to take advantage of that, you got to do it now before the night's over. What are our colors? We start in the front. We have the black, we have the purple, we have the lime green, which is really fun. We have the orange, we have the pink, and then we have the blue and the orange is the most limited. Limited. I have 200 left. All right, hand me that. Oh, thank you, because you can put, how clever, your Debbie Meyer green boxes you just got work inside here, don't they, Miss Kelly? Anything with a flat bottom. So a Debbie Meyer green box is perfect, perfect because it has the flat bottom. So you don't actually have to worry about what it's made of, whether it's glass, plastic, even like the frozen meals with the aluminum. I've even put a paper plate and I just covered it with aluminum foil. Anything with a flat bottom. So this is not just a traditional lunchbox. You'd pay about $25, $30 for a nice lunchbox. Guess what? That one doesn't plug in and cook your food. This one does. All right, this is what's so cool about it. 
about it. These are the six cup glass dishes, but you could do plastic or like you we said, we'll put that one there in just a second. This is, instead of going fast food, now I have a homemade meal. It's steamy. There's actually it's steam steamy. coming off It gets of it. to 165 degrees and it doesn't go over. So think of it like a slow cooker. It's not exactly a slow cooker. It's more sophisticated. But this is one of these. I always get them on BOGO. But rather than going to fast food at lunch, I'd prefer a healthier with vegetables and shrimp. And sure. So there's my homemade meal. And when you get to work, or let's say you're taking this, we talked to a lot of flight attendants, truck drivers, um, taxi drivers are the ones that drive, you know, for the different companies that transport folks. And they don't want to eat out because it's expensive. Now you can do your own food. It's not just going to reheat. It will reheat. It's amazing at reheating. But it's going to cook it from raw as well. If you want to do raw Wait, chicken slow down rest. one second. Explain that again. It'll cook, cook it. from raw. It's so really going to cook. This was cooked from raw right here. This is a frittata no, or just an omelet. Come on. And this one we actually got from you guys. It was an um, idea. Somebody was cooking it overnight. Now, it wouldn't take eight hours to cook. Let's say you were going to go to bed and sleep for eight hours. It would take maybe an hour or two. But because it only gets to 165 degrees, it will never overcook. So it does not matter that you will plug this in before you go to sleep. And by the time you wake up, Breakfast is ready. So if I go to work You're in a hotel it in, room, yep. if I go to work and just plug it in, yep. whenever I'm ready and have that little split second to eat lunch, then it's you're ready. ready to go. It's ready to go. Or breakfast. We talk to a lot of people that travel that obviously it's very expensive to eat out when you're traveling. Sure. Um, and therefore, they just go to the grocery store. They buy regular priced food at a grocery store rather than a fast food place. And they'll bring it back to their hotel room. This is literally a miniature oven. <laughs> Anywhere you go that has an electric outlet, whether it's on a job site, whether it's in an airplane, we talk to flight attendants that use this, um, whether it's in your car. My husband just bought a truck. It has the regular electric outlet now. Almost all cars do. Or you can buy the adapters that go right into any car. And all you can you use it in your car. Can you can imagine? use it in your car. You imagine you've got the kids in the car. You all got to go somewhere. You're literally taking your snack with them and it's cooking beside it's cooking you while you're next driving. To them. That's pretty awesome. Healthy food. So think yeah. of it as a lifestyle change because when you're on the go you're rushed you're eating unhealthy you're spending all this you're extra going money drive you're going through drive throughs flight attendants got sick and tired of eating expensive airport meals um hang on kelly real quick the purple i have less than 200 left the orange i'm sorry daryl i missed what you said I have 190 left. So the purple's almost gone. The orange is really, really limited. And this is one of those I so can buy in the freezer section, right? this is one of those you buy in right? the freezer section. Okay. You can buy any of those varieties. I mean, any of these, you know, companies, they all have the flat bottoms, right? right. So whether it's cardboard, paper, plastic. You guys are talking plastic. about if you're watching your weight, your yeah. calories, whatever, these things. Any of the little diet and ones. And this is frozen hard. And you can do it from frozen. Now, keep in mind, it gets to 165 degrees and never goes over 165 degrees. So, for example, um, I was telling you about my uh, cousin who's a kindergarten teacher she never had time to eat lunch until I gave her a hot logic she literally texted me and she said this has changed my life and I was like well that's awfully dramatic <laughs> what do you mean and she said because I only used to get 18 minutes to eat and if I had a frozen meal and my girlfriend had a frozen meal each of those took four minutes in the microwave now we're down to 12 minutes to eat right, right? and so now she plugs it in when she gets to work and anytime she has that moment to eat she now can eat whether it's her leftovers or or maybe Is this she a brought made lasagna? a made homemade lasagna. <laughs> and this can Did be fresh or frozen. We cooked it in there. <laughs> so it gets to 165 yes. degrees and never goes over. So if you want to oh, wait, make, let me ask you. So yes. if I don't get to it Put right away. Yes. Okay, here. Okay, it won't so burn. Here we go. You just got your Debbie Meyer green boxes, right? Put and your you lasagna got, in your Debbie Meyer your green box. Oh, it fits perfect. It fits too. perfectly. <gasps> That's awesome. Any meal, whether it's leftovers or fresh from fresh, will fit. And there's no dials or anything. It goes up to 165 degrees and stops. So it can't not overcook burn. it. Right. It will not burn your food. You can't even try and burn in here. And That's so a lot so of people, wild. like if they're taking care of their elderly aunt or grandmother or whatever it is, who can't use a stove anymore, will prepare meals for the week. And then all they have to do is pop it inside Hot Logic and they'll never burn it. It's is not that like a, dip? a stove. Did you do a dip? So this is one of the recipes that comes included. <laughs> it's a chili cheese dip. Oh, that looks good. And think of it like even at a party as a warmer. You could leak because it comes because the actual yeah, yeah. conduction heater and I'll show
show you over here comes out. So it can just be a warmer. So now you can enjoy your guests and enjoy your party without actually having to worry about your food getting cold. Okay, so what if we slap a little bit on it? You just wipe it clean. That's it. Yeah, because the plate comes out. That's Everything so is smart. wiped clean. Um, you can see it's double insulated. So it's a really high-end lunch tote as well. Uh, and then it has that conduction heater in the bottom. These two are both dips and they both uh, both of the recipes <laughs> come included. But like wherever the spinach dip is, is where the party is, right? And by the way, guys, if you, I don't know if you can see it, but there's literally steam rolling off oh, of this. Oh yeah, 165 so degrees is hot. It's just not a hot. lukewarm kind of yucky there experience. There yeah. 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 Oh, thanks it, 165 guys. degrees is, is hot. So if you're getting ready to eat it, it is going to be very warm, but it's not microwave warm where it's scalding, scalding you melt, and yeah. rubbery. This um, meatball recipe <laughs> comes included in the 10 recipes that you're getting with your Hot Logic. But there is an online community of Hot Logic that's crazy. People have thousands of recipes posted. Well, and just a point I noticed, that's what you're saying. If you just want to use it as a yeah, warm plate, you can just take it out. You literally take it out and then that's on your buffet. Yeah. I mean, you could serve off that. You can serve right off of it. This one I like because this is what a lot of us own, these little sectioned off, you know, compartments. Mm, perfect. This is leftover, you know, garlic bread. I've heated my garlic bread, my spaghetti, and my meatballs. So rather than going to fast food, I just saved myself $10. Oh, that's true. I mean, fast food for a single, I mean, $12 even, depends on where you go. Um, I gotta give a quick update though. Sorry, Cal, real quick. Four flex pays for right now, and I believe these are gonna sell out. So we've sold almost 800. You have four flex pays only for tonight. That's a big deal. And um, again, we have on flex, it's $9.90. Five cents. Wonderful, right? So you're going to save some money just because you can spread your payments out over four months. Also, we're $10 off tonight. It's a customer event price. The purple's almost gone and the orange is almost gone.